So was the cock was the caucus feeling today like the walkout was worth it? You know, yes. as you evaluate this, I mean, if the end was not what I think most people would have expected anywhere. You know, someday I'm going to write a book, but, you know, most things in this building are choreographed. And I think this whole session had some of that in it from both sides. Yeah. What are the lessons of this session then? You know, I've always said when people, uh, I think you both have heard me say a lot that I've, I've always worried that denial of quorum will be the norm and people use it every time they don't get their way and I still believe that, you know. Um, this, the first time we did it, the, um, I was kind of uh, very reluctant. I was the last one to actually sign on to it. This time I was like, this is a no-brainer, we did it. We did it to kill cap and trade. Why are we not doing it again? So I think everybody before this session even started knew that we were going to do it. And I think I think the Democrats took uh, as an opportunity to get into campaign mode because they loaded up all this pork and these budgets and everything and knew they were never going to pass them. And, and then they can blame it on us in election season. So... Probably some of that going on. Were you surprised 